So I remember when we first pulled out of the driveway, that feeling of freedom. I don't know, it was like a... Weight some sort lifted. Of, exactly right, like it's huge weight completely lifted off. I'm like, oh my God, we are exploring. Like we are going exploring Australia. Hi, I'm Tom. I'm Amy. And these are our four boys. And, and this, this is, is our life on the road. In any small town, in any state, anywhere in Australia, you might run into Tom, Amy, and their four boys because for the last five years, they've been exploring every corner of this continent in their caravan. Our lifestyle before traveling was just like everybody else. It was just work. Work and just work for the weekends was basically all we did. Tom would leave before the kids woke up, home in time for dinner, and yep. the kids would go to bed. Yeah, I was the grumpy dad. Oh, it just wasn't, I don't know, I think we just had enough, didn't we? Yeah. Unfortunately for us, it took my dad passing away at a young age that mm. made us realise that life, you just don't know what's around the corner. So we always worked, 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 worked. It was all about working hard and saving for the future, but unfortunately he didn't get to do that. No. Get the gear, let's get down the beach. We left in 2018 to do one lap around Australia. And we plan to do that over 10 to 11 months. Yeah, we, we sold up everything to basically relocate somewhere else. We wanted a, a change. And we pretty much did this loop all around the outskirt here. It's really good putting new lines on the, on the map. When we left, our only intention was to travel for 10 months. I think after travelling, we just got this whole appreciation for life, didn't we? Mm. Like, I think we just changed as we people. We changed a lot as people. We were huge consumers. And now we, we live in a little caravan and we are so content with what we've got. Less is more now. Yes. But it's not all fun and games on the road. We've been pretty lucky. We've been able to work with caravan parks. Amy does a lot of photography, so we're able to actually go around and take photos for caravan parks and create some content for them. But really the main thing is, is I repair caravans as, as we travel. Uh, me and Tyler will go and grab all our tools. Handy being right next door. It is. And, it is. Um, and then uh, we'll get cracking into it. Okay. You know, I was fixing my own caravan for a long time, you know, as we go along, and then I started helping other people repair their caravans when we get into a park, and I thought, yeah, I can, can do this as a job. But that's by no means their toughest job on the road. You ask any travelling family, it's more than likely it's going to be the schooling. All respect to teachers out there, because they do an amazing job. So we did 12 months of distance education, and then we're like, we can do this ourselves now. Yeah, we can absolutely teach our kids ourselves. Well, there's a lookout up here, boys. Basically, you can see how the water has actually formed the landscape, how it's come through. It's almost daily they change, oh, I want to do this when I'm older, I want to do this when I'm older, because they're experiencing so much. Apart from the eldest, he wants to be a marine biologist, and yep. that's it. Yeah, we've been to some incredible places over the five years, haven't we? I've got to say, when we first come into Yapoon, you come driving in, and there's a big hill and you come down and it and looks out over Yapoon. You see Great Keppel Island and all the keppels out the in distance. the distance, you're like, oh. And the water's blue, you're How like, How is yep. this joint? We've camped on beaches where you just, you jump in the water and you're swimming with turtles and sharks and we've climbed some incredible mountains. Oh, we've, and we've met some of the most beautiful people. We've made some amazing friends, haven't yeah. we? Oh, some incredible friends. And friends for life. It's not everyone's cup of tea. It still has its challenges, obviously, but the good far outweighs the bad times. Like, just how close we are as a family is, yeah. I, I can't put a price on that. We get to see our kids growing up every single day. If you want to see more of this travelling family's adventures, you can follow four boys in a caravan on Insta.